In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Today is day six of the Pentecost Novena. We pray for the spirit of understanding. Come, O spirit of understanding, and enlighten our minds, that we may know and believe all the mysteries of salvation, and may merit at last to see the eternal light in thy light, and in the light of glory, to have a clear, clear vision of, of Thee, and, and the, the Father, Father, and the Son. Amen. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be Thy name. Thy kingdom come, Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was, was in the, the beginning, beginning, is now, and, now, and ever shall, shall be, world, world without end. Amen. Together. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is, is now, now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Glory, Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the, the Holy Spirit. Spirit. As, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, now and, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Glory, Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As, as it was in the beginning, is now, is now and, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Glory, Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Spirit as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Act of Consecration to the Holy Spirit On my knees before the great multitude of heavenly witnesses, I offer myself, soul, and body to you, eternal Spirit of God. I adore the brightness of your purity, the unerring keenness of your justice and the might of your love. You are the strength and the light of my soul. In you I live and move and am. I desire never to grieve you by unfaithfulness to grace, and I pray with all my heart to be kept from the smallest sin against you. Mercifully guard my every thought and grant that I may always watch for your light and listen to your voice and follow your gracious inspirations. I cling to you and give myself to you and ask you by your compassion to watch over me in my weakness, holding the pierced feet of Jesus and looking at his five wounds and trusting in his precious blood and adoring his open side and stricken heart, I implore you, adorable spirit, helper of my infirmity, to keep me in your grace that I may never sin against you. Give me grace, O Holy Spirit, Spirit of the Father and the Son, to say to you always and everywhere, Speak, Lord, for your servant heareth. Amen. Prayer for the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. O Lord Jesus Christ, who before ascending into heaven did promise to send the Holy Spirit to finish your work in the souls of your apostles and disciples, deign to grant the same Holy Spirit to me that he may perfect in my soul the work of your grace and your love. Grant me the spirit of wisdom that I may despise the perishable things of this world and aspire only after the things that are eternal. The spirit of understanding to enlighten my mind with the light of your divine truth. The spirit of counsel 
that I may ever choose the surest way of pleasing God and gaining heaven, the spirit of fortitude, that I may bear my cross with you, and that I may overcome with courage all the obstacles that oppose my salvation, the spirit of knowledge, that I may know God and know myself, and, and grow perfect, perfect in the, the signs of the saints, the spirit, the spirit of, of piety, piety, that I may find the service of God sweet and amiable, and the spirit of fear, that I may be filled with a loving reverence towards God, and may dread in any way to displease Him. Mark me, dear Lord, with the sign of your true disciples, and, and animate, animate me in all things with your, your spirit. spirit. Amen. Amen. Come, a Holy Spirit. Come, a Holy Spirit. Fill the, fill the hearts, hearts of your faithful, faithful and kindle in us the fire of your love. love. Send forth your spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who has taught the hearts of the faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, Grant us that by the gift of the same Spirit we may be always truly wise and ever rejoice in His consolation through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.